Hey, what is up everybody? I'm DM and today we are playing some more Fortnite and in this uh, gameplay of Fortnite we will be finishing off the place top 12 in squads. Hopefully, I'm not sure, but I'm gonna try and I feel like we can, but we'll see. I don't like to make these uh, gameplay videos or whatever on my channel too long, but Sometimes I do, and I used to like doing it a lot, and I used to make long ep gameplay, but I don't want to do that at the start of my channel. I want to do that later on, or if it's a live stream or something. I mean, that makes sense, but if it's just a regular gameplay, I don't want to be recording for an hour of just straight Fortnite. And I, I don't really have the time to do that if I want to get other things out for everyone. Also, people have talked about like YouTubers, they've talked about things such as they don't like to play games anymore unless they're recording and that personally makes me kind of feel bad. Not really for them, but I mean, it kind of for them because games are an enjoyable thing that you're supposed to enjoy. And I mean, it's not that they don't enjoy it, because I'm sure they do. But it's something that I feel like you shouldn't have to record to enjoy it. And also, I don't want to ever get to that point where I just can't play a game because I need to be recording. Because if I come to that then it's just very bothersome for me because I love gaming I game all the time and if I can only do that and record and I don't want to over record things so I want to be able to play a game even though I'm not recording And I don't know why I haven't figured it out yet, but I get bored of games extremely easily. If there's not a game that I'm just hooked on, then I can get bored of a game really easily. Like, I can only play games, like, if I'm not hooked on it, like, I can do a game, like, they just came out and I'm really excited about it, like, basically, it just came out, I, I'm gonna say, like, Far Cry 5. I know Far Cry 5 has not just come out. It's been out for several months. Since like March, I think. Yeah, it's... Yeah. March. So... I'm somewhere around there. Anyways, so... If... When that game, like, just came out, and I really want to get it, and I get it and everything, and I'm going to be playing it for, like, a good while. So... I'll, I would play that game for like a couple days and stuff but if it's just a regular game that I've had for a while and there's nothing new to it there's no new content or anything then I just I get bored of it real easily 
and I will play it for like an hour and I will just leave and my uh, friend gets mad at me because of it because he's like to keep leaving games and stuff we have to keep switching games every like hour or hour and a half or whatever I'm like yeah I know but I just I can't keep playing this game there's just nothing that makes me want to keep playing it and I mean it bothers me too just because I can't play a game that I should play because I just get that bored of it. There's no reason that I should have done that much damage. I was like over here. Huh. Okay. Anyways, we're going to retry that. So. Basically. I just, I get bored of games too easily, and it personally bothers me, but, I mean, it bothers my friends and stuff, too. But if I'm just not that into a game at that time, then I can't play it that long. I mean, if I'm having a good time and everything, then I will keep playing it, because I'm having a good time, and... There's stuff to, like, the happiness to keep me going. But if there's no, like, enjoyment in what I'm doing, then I can't keep doing it. Like, if I'm just losing for an hour on CSGO or Rainbow Six Siege or whatever, and we just keep losing, and it's just not fun, it's the same thing over and over again. Kind of like Fortnite, I just keep dying over and over again. I haven't won a single solo win. That's how bad I am, first of all. It's just, can't really do it. So I can't play Fortnite that long. I mean, when I get the challenges, like the once a week or whatever, there's stuff to keep me going because it's the new challenges. But after that, I'm just sitting here replaying it over and over and over again. I don't understand how people can keep playing that for so long. I mean, unless you're a content creator, then I just get bored of it. I mean, if you're a content creator, then you're obviously getting paid to do what you're doing, so there's something to, there for you to do, and you're getting paid for it like a job. But if you're not, then it's just... Well, what's really the point? I mean, it just gets boring to me. I mean, if you enjoy it, then you do, and I mean, if you enjoy it, then keep doing it, but personally for me, I just can't play it that long, and that's why I've stopped making videos as much, but pretty much the only reason I'm making a video now is because I realize that it's in popular demand. Can't wash my hands. So I try to try get an enjoyment out of something so that way I can continue to play it. And 
it's part of a reason I haven't finished the uh, Dark Souls Remastered just because those types of games even if I'm really enjoying it and I right like right now I'm really enjoying the um, oh, what's it called uh, Death's Gambit and I'm really enjoying it because it's brand new and it's in a higher demand I guess but not just that but it's more of hmm Well, I like those types of games, and that's why I can keep playing it. But the other issue of why I can't keep playing it is because of the type of game it is. It's like a Souls type game, so it gets me mad pretty easily. <clears throat> and if I get mad, I don't want to play it, and then I'm not enjoying it and not having fun. But I mean, if I'm just beating bosses and clearing out areas and stuff like that, then I'm enjoying it and having a good time and I can keep playing it. But after a while I will get bored of it just because I can't keep playing a game that long. Like after five hours of gaming I just I have to take a break. I can't keep going on. I mean I technically I could and I like I can. I'm just not going to. Because I know I need to get up and do something for a little bit. So it normally take like an hour, hour and a hour, half an hour ish. And I'll just sit there and do something. Like watch YouTube videos or eat or something like that. Sometimes I can have. And I'm probably going to be live streaming tomorrow, hopefully, on uh, Dust Gambit. I'm hoping to be live streaming tomorrow. I don't want to record something, I just don't know if whether or not it will be. If it'll be uh, Dust Gambit or not. I'm thinking it will be, but I don't know if I want to. Like, I don't know if I want to live stream that. Like, I know I want to record it, I just don't know, like, if I'm going to record it anytime soon or not, or something along those lines. But. I don't know if. I'm going to be recording that right away for a series because I'm starting school in a week. Like, I gotta go into school next week. So, I don't want to really have. Not that I don't want to have a series going when I'm in school. Because I, I would. I mean, I don't really care if I do or not. But more of. I don't have to worry about a series while I'm in school. I don't have to worry about doing something all the time while I'm in school. And I will still be recording and uh, streaming. I don't know, I probably won't be doing it as much obviously, but I sh still should be doing it. So oh yeah, I should still be um, uploading and streaming. I probably won't be streaming as much just because streaming takes longer for me because I have to be talking for like a couple hours or so. Because if I'm gonna stream, I don't want to just stream for 30 minutes. I want to stream for hour or more. I don't want to just stream for like 20 minutes and be like, alright, I'm done. I'm going to be streaming for like an hour or two. 
And I can't always do that, and I know I won't be doing that daily. But I can't always stream for a couple hours when I'm in school. So I won't be doing it as much. But I should still be doing it. Maybe like once a week, I'm thinking, at least, hopefully. That's just at least. I'm me do it like, like, once or twice a week, something along those lines. But when I'm recording, it just takes like 30 minutes to an hour, maybe. Yeah, it just takes like 30 minutes to an hour, normally. It doesn't take too long, but when I'm streaming, I'm streaming for a couple hours or so. Like when I streamed for three and a half hours at some point last week. But when. So I can just. I can get videos up faster. like one to two videos every other day ish I say ish because I can't promise every day but normally like every other day I can and that's kind of the schedule I'm on like I didn't think I was gonna have enough time to get this second video out today but I have time now too so it's good I didn't think I was going to, but, uh, because my stepfather got home earlier than he normally would, because he got a new job today. It's pretty cool, but I enjoy my time alone, because, you know, when I'm with someone all the time, I enjoy my time alone every now and then. So, I enjoy when I get to have time alone. And normally I would listen to music or something, but I really need to get this video out. I would just listen to video or music and play games. But I know I need to uh, get this video out, so I, that's what I'm doing now. And then after this, I'll probably go play a game or, or I'll play Dead by Daylight and uh, listen to some music. I wanted to record Dead by Daylight, but I did that earlier today, and I don't want to... I don't like uploading two of the same thing, unless it's a series, and Dead by Daylight's not really a series. So, I don't really, uh... don't really want to put two of those up a day and I don't want to spam just a bunch of Dead by Daylight videos because I'm not a Dead by Daylight YouTuber and I don't want to be a YouTuber that makes one video or like one type of something like I know my content will pretty much always be game games or something surrounding games like even it's making even if it's making a game or something or coding or something along those lines. I pretty much all I should pretty much always be doing games. 
because that's what I centered my contents around and that's drop my mic that's great so that's what I've centered my content around because that's what I enjoy but But I see these YouTubers that, like, a dude named Varsity Gaming, he does a lot of Rainbow Six, and that's pretty much it. And he's pretty much talked about that where he doesn't really like to do one thing all the time, but that's pretty much what his channel kind of is and what it's been centered around and everything like that. And I, d I don't really want to do that, nor am I really going to, just because, like I was talking about, I get bored of a game pretty easily, and I can't just do one game all the time. And he says uh, pretty much what he does to keep that from happening is that he'll just not watch any videos on it or whatever, and he'll only play it when he really has to, like recording or live streaming or whatever. And that's his way of doing it. And I approve of that. But I just... I can't just do one game. And there's another YouTuber that does Dead by Daylight. And I forget what his YouTube channel name is. Because I don't watch him all the time. I watch him occasionally. But he basically only does Dead by Daylight. And there's nothing wrong with that. If that's what you do or enjoy. But that's not what I enjoy. I enjoy all types of games. It doesn't really matter what type of game it is to me. It's so long as I enjoy it. Because I don't enjoy all, all games. Some games I despise and just completely do not like. But then there are some that I absolutely love. And even the ones I absolutely love and the ones that I'm actually really good at... I still don't like to play all the time. Like even the game that I'm like the best out of, of, like out of all of my friends that I've beaten all the time and just it's awesome is uh, Mario Kart. I'm actually really good at Mario Kart. Took my uh, best friend to a a gaming con type of thing where it was like a gaming convention. I've talked about this in one of my videos, I think, but at, uh, we went there and we got on the old Super Nintendo and played the, uh, I think it was the very first Mario Kart, and I still beat him on there, and then we played Mario Kart 8, and I beat him on there, we played Mario Kart 7, beat him on there, it's just, it was a lot of fun, and it's kind of funny, because I told him, I'm like, I'm going to beat you in this game, he's like, well, you probably will, but I'm still gonna try. I'm like, yeah, go ahead. This is fun. But, anyways, I'm not the best, and I probably never will be. Because, first of all, I'm not gonna play that much in one game. Because I just, I can't play a game that much. I can play games that much I just can't play a win game that much that's why I can never get really good at a game it's because I can't put enough time into it I put enough time into gaming overall just not one particular game that's why when you see these really good gamers at these one game or whatever it's because they put a lot of time into it but I just I can't but anyways that's me talking about this. But I hope you enjoyed this. And see you guys next time. I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. Probably I'll probably start on the That's Gambit series. And I'll probably live stream it a little bit on Twitch. So if you want, go check out my Twitch channel. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.